Despite coming in for high praises for their work in encouraging trade in the non-energy sector, the National Export Facilitation Organization of Trinidad and Tobago, Export TT, also got a tongue lashing from the chairman of the Public Accounts Enterprises Committee, and Senator Wade Mark indicated that the auditing system at the organization left a lot to be desired. He said he was confused as to why unauthorized people were signing checks at the organization and why banks were accepting the signatures. That is one aspect. The second aspect, those who have authority to sign checks, Mr. Karim, Mr. Harry Passat, Mrs. Benjamin, they are signing checks over and above their authorized limit. So they are authorized to sign checks for 10,000. They are signing checks for 15,000, 20,000, 30,000. In response, General Manager of Operations at Export TT, Maria Padilla Benjamin, admitted that there was confusion in the 2020 audit. There were two banking and signing resolutions in the same year. So a decision was taken with a list of signatories, and at some point in the same year, another decision was taken. But the first set of individuals were not advised of the second change, and so continued because the instrument that was presented to them said, you are authorized until so told. 